everyone. It is Saturday, October 2nd. The time right now is 1.30 p.m. and the temperature is around 21 degrees Celsius. I'm here on Cumberland Street in the Yorkville neighborhood. And there's a look at the e-scooter and I just got back from a ride that went across the entire length of College Street. And since once again they're running shuttle buses on Young Street for Line 1, I think between Bloor Young Station and Shepherd Station. That would mean either taking my e-scooter onto the subway or riding home. So I have opted to ride home. So let me just hop on the e-scooter here and I'll head over to Young Street and then head north and battle the shuttle buses on my way up. Okay, I am ready to go here. Just take the scooter down to the street. Where there seems to be a fair bit of traffic. It's nothing I can't slip through. And Bel Air Street here is close to traffic to the north. And coming up is Bay Street. So I think I'll turn south on Bay and head down to Bloor and I'll take that over to Young. It's a great place to park. Wow, there are people parked improperly all over the place today. So this is Blue Street West. Just want to get to Young. I'll turn north, that's where Blue Young Station is. Careful! Watch out! What are you talking about? That guy's an idiot. <laughs> Walking into the bike lane. Without looking, <laughs> and the guy said, careful, you too. I'm gonna turn north on the Young Street here. I gotta go back and watch that video again. See what exactly I did wrong there. I anticipated them doing something stupid and I verbally warned them. Let's hear that or ring the bell or both. And there is a parade of shuttle buses and a very long line of people. And that's what I didn't want to have to deal with with the e-scooter. I'll easily have enough battery to get home though. Okay. I think there was a New Jersey license plate on that car. Oh, fun times, and it's north on Yorkville. See if I can keep pace with this shuttle bus. Probably not. I am north of downtown. 
And I think the neck on my e-scooter has come a little loose. When I hit a bump, you can hear it kind of rattling a bit louder than it normally would. Which is weird, because I thought I just tightened it. I'll take a look at that when I get home. It's not a huge deal. And here is a shuttle bus past number two. Maybe I can make a game of this. Is an e-scooter faster than the shuttle bus? That's two buses down. Here's number three. is number five. I'll start subtracting when they start to pass me, which is inevitable at some point. That was nice of me to leave enough room for No problem. <laughs> that was an interesting conversation. I don't even think they knew each other. So that's five shuttle buses. down by some slower riders, but I'll give them space. You didn't know that guy? No. What the hell? <laughs> no, he... He's just having a bad day or something? No, him. Oh, yeah. I, I... Yeah, like, well, he bolted right in front of me at a red light and kind of... Oh, yeah, I saw that. <laughs> I'm like, oh, well, <laughs> All right, so that explains that. Everyone's having fun out here today. Hit a red light here, and then there'll be a bit of a hill climb. So this is Shaftesbury, so just to the right is Summerhill Station. Here's where a shuttle bus will definitely have a good chance to pass me. I'll be going quite slow up this hill. feeling the neck of the e-scooter. I don't know if I can get that in the shot, but it's definitely on the loose side. Oh, this is nice. Their window is closed, otherwise I was going to give them an earful of something.
and I'm going a whopping, whopping 18 kilometers per hour. No, you don't. So, those shuttle buses have yet to catch back up to me. And I'm about to track down a few more. Coming up is St. Clair Station. This bus says not in service on it. Let's see, are there people on it? No, so that one does not count. Not that I passed it. Here's where Young Street typically moves pretty good between here and Davisville. It has been reduced to one lane to make room for this bike lane, which was a fantastic improvement to Young Street. It's long overdue. I don't see any shuttle buses coming up behind me. It's worth noting the top speed on this is 24 kilometers per hour. There are scooters out there that would easily be able to outgun the bus. But I am relying on traffic congestion and the fact that they're all probably packed and take a while to unload and load up new passengers in order to stay ahead. I just looked over my shoulder, I didn't see any. Mount Pleasant Cemetery on the right and on the left are where the subway tracks are above ground. And here's where Young Street is briefly two lanes again. There's plenty of room for a bus to catch up to me, but again, I don't see any. So I'm anticipating a pretty big line of people waiting for the bus probably at Davisville and Eglinton stations coming up. So this is the Midtown neighborhood of Young and Davisville. Davisville subway station is just on the left. And on the other side of the intersection here is where the P 
people will be queuing up to board the northbound train, although this usually isn't the busiest subway station. You can see a number of people waiting to get on the southbound train. Train. Bus, although one of the problems with these shuttle buses is you have the major choke points at Eglinton and a few of the busier stations where if you're not getting on at one of those stations and then you're waiting at the stop after like Davisville where probably nobody is getting off, you might have to wait for several buses before you can even get on one. They should probably be sticking fresh buses in partway down the line just to handle that issue. I've been there before. And coming up is Eglinton where the last stop I'll be passing is. And there's a few buses behind me. I don't know if I was able to turn the camera around all the way, probably not. It is strapped to my chest. I just have to get to the choke point just up ahead at Young and Eglinton before the buses get there. And I'll have successfully raced them to Eglinton from Young and Bloor. Yeah, I don't think there's any chance of them catching me at this point. And what's really crappy is last weekend, the TTC was running shuttle buses along this stretch of Young Street. I think that was the excuse they gave was LRT construction at Eglinton Station. And this week's excuse is the automated traffic control system that they're installing. you'd board the north or southbound buses at Eglinton Station. I'm going to cheat and hang out on the right here in the construction area. Bus number six passed. And here's bus number seven. Victory is clearly mine on this day. And I could probably squeak through a few more buses ahead, but yeah, let's do it. I was thinking maybe I'll turn left, see if I can pull a few more in. I'm turning just up ahead here at Montgomery. It's kind of a tight squeeze. I really doubt I'll be able to pass this one. too soon. Is that number eight? I'll have to go back and rewatch the video. But I think it was. There's the Duke of Kent on the right. And a lot of restaurants these days are employing security guards at the front door. Rather than relying on the wait staff.
Here's the Rosen Crown Pub on the right. There is bus number nine in front of me, although I won't get to pass it. So I'm just gonna turn left here. bring things to a close. I hope you enjoyed this ride versus the shuttle buses up Young Street. Let me know your thoughts and comments down below. I don't know which channel I'm going to post this one on, but if it's on Johnny Stride's channel, there are links to my Patreon and YouTube member memberships in the description. Maybe I'll just put those there as well if it's the other channel and there's the scooter all right thank you for watching and i will catch you on the next one